y'all ain't subscribing and I don't like that. Hello you guys and welcome back to my channel. This is the Black Rapunzel and in today's video I'm going to be giving you guys my first impressions on the Honey Curls hairline as well as how I get my perfect washing up. If you're not already subscribed, please go and do that and be sure to like and comment on this video. So for those of you who don't know, the Honey Curls hairline is actually the um, product line that I'm now a brand ambassador for. So this is what it looks like. This is my day four to five hair. And I haven't really done anything to it, honestly, besides just refreshing it just a little bit. But I don't really like to touch my hair all that much. Y'all know that. In the video, you'll see that I'm kind of like partially showing you guys my detangling routine but if you guys want to see like a full video on that please just leave it below in the comments i have no problem making a video like that it'll take me no time for shampoo i used this lavender and rosemary shampoo this shampoo first of all i want to just say all of her products has so much slip y'all honestly like my wash day went by so smoothly i love rosemary i love minty shampoos i have problem scalp you guys know that so anything with mint rosemary anything like that is a big plus so i really 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 did like this the conditioner that i used was the lavender and rosemary conditioner and this conditioner has so much slip you can see in the video that I put my brush underneath the water just to give it extra slip. But honestly, it wasn't even necessary to do that, y'all. Like, that just made it easier. This has really great slip. I love it. And it smells amazing. This deep conditioner was my favorite part of this whole entire process. It just... It was just so soft and so creamy and so wonderful. I'm very obsessed with deep conditioners because I feel like that's a very important step in your wash routine. Like That can really make or break your whole style you're about to do if you don't properly moisturize your hair. Okay, so to get started, I'm going to be styling my hair, which is a wash and go. I'm going to be showing you guys how I shingle as my cream. I'm going to use her daily moisturizer, and I've actually used this, and it was amazing. I talked about it in my life. This was really, really soft, and it smells amazing. It smells like... It smells like a cup. For my styler, my gel, I'm, of course, going to be using the Gold Eagle Styler Gel. And for my oil, I'm going to be using the oil that came with the uh, product line, Honey Curls. It is the growth serum um, and a water bottle. My water bottle actually contains warm water, kind of like hot to warm. Like it works the products into my hair better and I get a better outcome of my wash and go whenever I use like a hot to warm water than regular cold water. That's just me. I don't necessarily know if it's legit, but I would be happy if, you know, you guys would try it out and let me know if, you know, if you feel like it made a difference. It, we're gonna split our hair into two sections. Okay, and now we're going to split this section into two as well. So, you split this section also into another one. But instead of getting another clip, you could just twirl, just wrap it around. This is the small section that we're gonna start off with. And I'm gonna take some of the daily moisturizer. Uh, I like my hair to be super, super duper moisturized. So, you know, I just, I don't apply a specific amount of product. I just kind of apply until I feel like, oh, you guys, my hair feels so fucking soft. Wow. This is such a smooth and soft product. I'm looking at my hair like in the camera. Oh my God. What the fuck? 
highly, highly recommend this daily moisturizer. Okay, what I like to do is take my dimming brush and run it through my hair after I apply my first product just to make sure that it got on every strand. Take a generous amount of your gel. I'm probably going to add in more. It just really depends. Now you're going to put the gel all completely throughout your hair. Make sure you get it on every single strand because it is very important that the product is very much evenly distributed throughout your hair and that every piece of your hair like has product on it and is moisturized. Now, I'm just going to spray it just a little. It's already really wet, so I don't really have to spray it much, but I just want the warm water on it. And now we are going to shake it. Take the section and you just have it like this. All you do is you take the tiniest piece of curl and you run your finger through it and the section kind of like twirl it with your finger almost and then run the product down throughout the whole strand. Twirl, make sure you're running the product down the whole entire strand. And that's the first piece. And you're just gonna keep doing this. You're gonna take like, you're literally taking curl by curl and you're just making sure to rake through the product on each individual piece of curl. Now, I know this might seem like a long process, but honestly, it's not. Your curls are already separated, so it doesn't really take long to just grab a curl, run the product down it, and then move on. So, you're just going to keep following that motion. Make sure you guys are touching your roots. And you're just going to keep doing that. I don't scrunch until I'm finished with the section. Just because. Just because. Really. If you feel like a piece of hair that you picked up feels a little dry. Or they feel like there isn't much product on it. You can always go in with whatever product that you choose or water if you feel like you have enough product in your hair and just run it down the strand usually i'll just go in with a little water on my hand and like i'll run it down the strand just you know to kind of activate the product a little bit my hair just feels so damn soft this is insane see how my curls this is like more than one curl right here but i want it to be a full curl so I'm going to take a little bit of gel and I'm just going to run it against the strand and twirl it with my finger. Curl. I twirl more so towards the roots just so they can be defined and then I'll just run the product down the rest of the hair. You're just going to take it and scrunch really softly you don't want to manipulate your hair too much because you can mess up you know the process that you just did but this is what the first section looks like the curls are very defined they're very pretty and my hair is extremely soft
take it and scrunch really softly. You don't want to manipulate your hair too much because you can mess up, you know, the process that you just did. But this is what the first section looks like. The curls are very defined. They're very pretty. And my hair is extremely soft. <laughs> apply the oil directly to my scalp and then I just massage it in my scalp and on my ends and like just all throughout my hair and I just leave it like that like for the week I don't continuously put more oil throughout the week I hope you guys enjoyed this week's video Please tune in for the next one be sure to subscribe like and comment and thank you guys for watching